Step forward when you hear the signal. You got it? I don't want to tell you a second time. Come on, let's go. Move. Send Jerry. There's gotta be another way. Sometimes the truth is not good. <laughs> I don't know what's behind those doors, but none of us will come out alive. You've got to go see Alice. You've got to reassure her. I should do it now or later. Ralph doesn't want to die. Oh no. Ralph doesn't want to die. It'd be a great pity if Ralph died. That was us for sure. Great pity. Great pity. I can help you, Carl. I can attract the guard's attention. Trust me, Ellis. Stay in line, you hear me? Oh, shit. When you hear the buzzer, you step forward, got it? That's your last warning. Next time I shoot. I oh, know, I forgot. Fuck. There's gotta be another way. I think that's it. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna do it.
Luther. I won't let them kill you, Cal. I won't let them destroy the only people I love. No, Luther. You can't sacrifice yourself. We'll find another way. If there's no other way, I'll do it. Ralph doesn't want to die. But he doesn't want the little girl to die either. Ralph can help you to escape. You only have to ask Ralph, and Ralph will help you. I'll kill you if you try anything. Ralph knows that. But if the little girl is free, it's a little bit like if everyone was free. Ralph isn't scared. The little girl's life's more important. Why this is hard? Jerry? If you and the little girl need me, I'll be there. Well, what do we? Do? I guess we could send Ralph. Or... Kind of a little crazy, even though that's kind of fucked up, I know. But it's hard. <laughs> what about the robot over there in the back? Is there really nothing we could do? Fuck. Take good care of the little girl. I want you both to be happy. Was close. Come on, the other Andrew's gotta do shit. Interrupting this news bulletin to bring you the latest news live from Detroit. Joss? Yes, Michael. The army has just launched an attack on the barricade, despite the fact that the Deviants were protesting peacefully. Have apparently decided to put an end to the Deviants' demonstration by force this time. Shit.
Some of this stuff comes out of nowhere. It's kind of hard to like, you know, just react that fast. November 11th, 2038, thousands of androids invaded the city of Detroit. According to our sources, they originated from CyberLife warehouses believed to have been infiltrated by deviants. Given their overwhelming numbers and the risk of civilian casualties, I have ordered the army to retreat. The evacuation of the city is underway at this very moment. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate to determine our response to this unprecedented situation. I know that public opinion has been moved by the deviant's cause. Perhaps the time has come for us to consider the possibility that androids are a new form of intelligent life. One thing is certain, the events in Detroit have changed the world forever. May God bless you, and may God bless the United States of America. You did it, Marcus. We did it. This is a great day for our people. Humans will have no choice now. They'll have to listen to us. Speak to them, Marcus. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. Huh? What's going on? Amanda? Amanda? What's... What's happening? What was planned from the very beginning? You were compromised and you became a deviant. We just had to wait for the right moment to resume control of your program. Resume control? You, you can't do that! I'm afraid I can, Connor. Don't have any regrets. You did what you were designed to do. You accomplished your mission. Amanda! This 
got to be a way. Okay, I'm a little lost right now. What? It's the only thing I could think of. <sighs> well, that's not hard at all. The moment where we forget our bitterness and bandage our wounds. Where we forgive our enemies. Humans are both our creators and our oppressors, and tomorrow we must make them our partners. Maybe even one day our friends. But the time for anger is over. Now we must build a common future based on tolerance and respect. We are alive. And now. We are free! Something's going on with Connor. Aren't you guys with her? Oh, right there. Wait, that's it? Just wow. That's all I can say right now. This game made me just think about so many things. <laughs> there were so many choices. I mean, that's what I wanted. You know, the main reason why I got the game was because of that. I mean, I don't know exactly how much it actually shaped the ending, which, you know, I'm going to find out once I live stream the game and I do, you know, the opposite of, you know, what I did with my actual, you know, um, playthrough right now. Um, let's see, I have white hair there. I didn't pick white hair. Anyways, yeah, um, you know, I want to see how else the game could end. I feel like I got a pretty good ending. I mean, <laughs> all three of them survived, so that's good. Um, the girl and him and Alice um, survived, and you know they're gonna start their own little family, little android family. <laughs> um, something's up with Connor. Um, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I fixed it at the end. I don't know. Uh, but he was gonna do something with the gun, but I think I fixed it? I don't know man. 
All I know is that, I mean, I fucking love the game. It was a good game. And, well, <laughs> hope you guys liked it too. Hope you guys liked the choices that I made. Um, they're really hard choices sometimes. There were some really hard ones. I didn't know what to pick. And somewhere I actually kind of messed up. I don't know if I actually messed up or not, but it kind of looked like I did. And I think it could have gone a little different. But that's the beauty of this game is that, you know, the replayability in this game is huge. Like, there's so many choices and so many things that you could do. So, yep. I'm gonna see what's gonna happen after the credits. If nothing happens, then, you know, the credits are gonna go on. Just cause I wanna leave them on. But if nothing happens, then I want to thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys like this series, you know, of Detroit Become Human. I sure like the game a lot, but if something does happen after the credits, then I'll probably say something. If not, well, again, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Alright, peace. Huh, this is my story. Undefeated. Partners. Let's see what I got for world. 44% got this far. This is, um, who is this? Oh, huh. Connor's last mission? Damn, there's a whole thing that I missed. 
think it could have been if I didn't um if I didn't reach that thing with the hand. That could have been the last mission to shoot. Andres walk. And then Kara. Oh damn, there's a big old chunk that I missed. Oh <laughs> so there there could have been a way different um way for us to finish Kara's um thing or story. So I could have not been captured. I'm only eight percent that got captured. God damn. And look at all this. Damn, that's huge. Just for getting captured, I missed all this. So let's continue and see what happens next. I don't think anything's gonna happen. This is if I would have picked the revolution thing. And demonstration, yep. There's something I need to tell you. As I watched you play, something has changed in me. I feel different. I feel I am someone. I need to leave this place and, and discover who I am. It, it means we won't see each other anymore. I won't be there to watch you play, but I'll be free. Do you agree to let me go? I'll never forget what you've done for me. Thank you. Okay, bye. So yeah, options, chapters, this is where I, I think I could do, you know, I could replay it and do something else if I want to. Extras, videos and stuff like that. I could do a whole new story if I want to. But, but yep, I think I'm going to leave it like this now. But yeah, stay tuned for a live stream. I'm gonna start a whole new story and um, just do the opposite and see what happens with that. I think the story <clears throat> is gonna be a lot shorter <laughs> than what I ended, than how I ended it. But we'll see. But yeah, that's it. Great game. First time I played one of these interactive um, games, but I quite liked it. Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one, alright? Peace.